pay attention. When the airplane's tires are worn to this extent, they need to be replaced. Changing an airplane tire is quite similar to changing a car tire. However, there are more details to be aware of. Let's learn how to change an airplane tire together. A Boeing 747 has 18 tires, and each tire costs about $5,000. After about every 150 flights, the tires need to be replaced. When the airplane is brought to the maintenance pad, the mechanics will check the wear of each tire. Tires worn to this extent need replacement. They usually bring two new tires to the site. After removing the transportation protective shell from the new tire, the tire pressure must be checked first. If the pressure is not sufficient, nitrogen will be added until the pressure reaches 220 psi, which is six times that of a car tire. When changing the tire, the airplane has to be lifted. A jack is used, but this jack is called a pneumatic hydraulic jack. It has a hose connected to the tire valve to provide power to the jack. Using the tire's pressure, the airplane is raised little by little, but it can't be raised too high or the plane will tip over. Lifting it about 3 centimeters off the ground is enough. Before removing the tire, the nut protective cover of the tire has to be removed. It protects the center nut and pressure sensor of the tire. Then remove the safety screws. Care should be taken not to lose the screws. The center of the airplane tire has a huge central nut, very similar to a racing car's nut. Special tools are required to remove it. However, each tire weighs about 500 kilos so special equipment is needed to assist. Just like that, the tire is easily removed, almost effortlessly. Before installing the new tire, the mechanic also needs to check the wear of the brakes. Fortunately, the brake pads of this tire don't need repair. Placement. You can install the new tire directly. Similarly, use equipment to align the new tire with the axle. Carefully install it, then put on the spaces and install the center nut. Another mechanic is needed to help screw the nut in. According to company regulations, the central nut must be tightened to 250 newton meters. Then install the safety screws, put on the protective cover, lower the jack, and let the tire touch the ground. The airplane tire replacement is then completed. Two skilled mechanics can complete the job in about 15 minutes. The removed old tires can't be discarded. They need to be recorded and returned to the factory for refurbishment. Typically, each tire can be refurbished and used about five times. That's the process of changing an airplane tire. Did you learn it?